Um, okay, so yeah, just putting that away. Now I want to dig into. So Ayn Rand, she has the Institute, and uh, what were the what were the cornerstones of her teaching that she got from Aristotle? Individualism, uh, freedom of individualism, the importance of that. So certainly uh, an aspect of individualism. I mean, uh, uh, Aristotle, remember, 2,500 years ago, so not everything he said was true, not everything he said was right, uh, but he, he got, the big picture he got right. Reality is what it is. You know, you don't create it. You don't make it up. Um, you know, maybe it was a, in his world there was a, a prime mover that set it in motion, but is not involved in all miracles. It just, it is what it is. Just accept that. That's a big part of thinking. Accept reality for what it is. And you have a tool to know reality, reason. Reason is Aristotle's great achievement. The emphasis on reason, the importance of reason. Reason only individuals have. We don't have a collective consciousness. You can't eat for me. You can't think for me either. Only I can do my own thinking. So many people rely on other people to do their thinking for them, right? That's a Well, even today we're seeing media headlines saying, don't do your own research. Yes. It's dangerous. Yes. Don't think for yourself. Trust the experts. Always do your own research. Now, in some areas, you need experts, right? I, you know, I don't know medicine to all its details, but do enough research to know which experts to rely on. Not all the experts agree. Do enough research so if the expert says something wacky, you know, wait a minute, l let me look at this more carefully. Um, so yeah, I don't pretend to know quantum physics. I'm gonna rely on experts, but I'm gonna do research about which experts I rely on. And, and it, so, they, so there's a level at which I don't wanna condemn experts. I love experts, I love that they, I, I don't know how to build one of these computers. Right. I know how to do this setup, right? I know how it works, the internet or whatever. I rely on experts to make it work. But if I had to know how it worked, I could at least know enough, I could research enough. So um, yeah, think, you know, think for yourself, thinking is an attribute of an individual. And then of course, the purpose of thinking, the purpose of, of, of you, the purpose of life, of living, is it, to be successful at it. it it's, to, it's to be happy. Um, you don't live out of a sense of duty. You don't have to. Um, it, it shouldn't be something that's a burden. It should be something that's fun. Uh, you know, and, and, and you should structure your life in a way. You should get to the point in life where, well, of course, not every moment, you know, is, is an orgasm, right? But you want it all to be building up to a good life, to a feeling that, yeah, this is, this is I'm enjoying life, life is meaningful, life is good for me, and I'm happy. And so, so that's part of it. And of course, the only political system, just to finish up kind of the key points in Ayn Rand's philosophy, the only political system that leaves you free to live your life based on your values, in pursuit of your happiness, based on your reasoning, is capitalism. It's a system that leaves you free, leaves you alone. The government is there only to protect you from somebody who might do you harm, to, uh, to protect you from fraudsters, to protect you from muggers, but otherwise you're free to live your life as you see fit. So, uh, you know, she has, a, she has a position throughout, including in, in aesthetics and what kind of art uh, one should pursue and why art is important for your life. Most people are not that interested in that, although they should be. But uh, she has this comprehensive philosophy that the bottom line of the entire philosophy is how to live a good life, how to flourish. So Thank you for listening or watching the Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one of those uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Your Own Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and of course subscribe. Press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.